We are gathered here to celebrate a very special love between Christy and Tim. Tim and Christy, your marriage today is the public joining of your souls that have already been united as one legally and in your hearts. Marriage will allow you a new environment to share your lives together, standing together to face life and the world hand in hand. Marriage is going to expand you as individuals, as each is committed to seeing God's best flourish in the other. It will define you as a couple as you deepen your love for one another. You will need strength. You will need courage. You will need patience. Perhaps most of all, a good sense of humor. May you wake and fall in love all over again, every day. And with Tim, I know that you are going to take care of our Chris. Chris and Chris, don't forget. Chris and Chris. <laughs> don't get confused. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. So I wish you all the best. That's my, my real wish. And I hope that you have a good family soon. Hopefully lots of children. <laughs> I've seen yeah. I've seen her ups and downs, been her through her dates and breakups and this thing. So we cried together. Just very happy to witness her um, walk down the aisle and marry the person that God prepared for her. This is what we really prayed for. And um, this is such a um, blessed day. Um, not for not only for them and also for the people who love them. And we're very happy. Present team, best wishes for, for you. Wish all, you. Wish, wish all the best. And may God be the pleasure with shower and blessings. For team and team and Chris. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, yeah. Cheers. Drop it. <laughs>
Love today we get to say publicly in front of gathered family and friends what our hearts already say every morning. I love you. For us, loving across the gap has meant a million small and often invisible ways that we order our days in thoughtfulness and connectedness to each other. Today it's not invisible. Today we share our love with others and let them glimpse how powerfully Christ's love in us can overcome, hold on to and restore, and He has taken what is broken in us, even in our loving, and births it anew with beauty and fresh life. We've chosen the butterfly as our symbol, and I promise to go to the cocoon with you over and over as Christ makes us new and makes us own. You have one wing, I have the other. Together we'll fly. Mahal kita. Another ring again. Oh, it's a butterfly ring. It's a pierce and a necklace. necklace. Alrighty, butterfly! Where did my wings go? I could have sworn I could fly. In the sight of God and the presence Turn of these witnesses, the take sky. Mary Christy Cadillone to be your wedded wife. To live together after God's ordinance in the holy state of matrimony? Will you love, honor, and cherish her in sickness and in health, in prosperity and adversity, and forsaking all others, cling only to her so long as you both shall live? If so, answer, I do. I do. The shoes represents your leading, leadership, authority, guidance, my partner in every step. Belt represents wholeness, equipped, discipline, security, comfort, helper, my mentor. It's 23 indeed, happy one year, and looking forward for togetherness to come and to stay. Hi love, God is faithful, God is great. Happy anniversary and Philippine wedding to us. God has been good to us. Thank you for being my light, comfort, and encouragement. You are indeed my best friend and other half. Let's enjoy the rest of our trip with our loved ones and on the wedding day. I love you so stinking much. Love, Christy. You, Mary Christy Cadiona, in the sight of God and the presence of these in, uh, witnesses, take Timothy King to be your wedded husband to live together after God's ordinance in the holy state of matrimony? Will you love, honor, and cherish him in sickness and in health, in prosperity and in adversity, and forsaking all others, cling only to him so long as you both shall live? If so, answer, I do. I do that. Christy, enjoy your marriage to the full and always give thanks to God for each other. So let us join our hands and clapping our hands in thanksgiving to God for this newlywed couple, Tim and Christy. a wonderful night um, it's 
been fascinating to think about the path that Tim has taken in his life and the path that Christy has taken in her life. And I just remember thinking, uh, as Tim grew into a young man and I began to pray for uh, someone that I thought he would marry, and I didn't know who this person was. Um, he had some girlfriends, and you know, you think maybe that's the one, but it wasn't. And I knew that he was an unusual enough person that it would take a special woman to be his wife. <laughs> and I prayed. What? <laughs> Crazy enough. Crazy enough for Tim. I prayed for a person I didn't know. I prayed that God would give Tim a wife that would fit him well. And he is kind of an unusual guy, so I wasn't just any girl. I knew it would have to be a special girl. And I prayed for that girl, and I didn't know who she was. Now I do. And she is perfect. She is, she is that person. And I praise God for her. Even in the hardest times, we found our way home, driving through the darkest of nights. All I wish is for you to love my daughter unconditionally and to take care of her for the rest of her life. And so with Christy to do the same. I hope that your love with each other will grow more stronger each day with the blessing of the Almighty Father. And may you bless with beautiful children and to have a very wonderful and happy family as the years go by. There's a beauty that guides us Like a fire in the night As the sun shines upon each new day There's a beauty that guides us Like a fire in the night As the sun shines upon Stay.